back with another library haul this week. Um, I apologise from the beginning if you hear some car noise in the background. I've got the windows open because it's still boiling hot, you know, mini heat wave right here. So um, this week, uh, before I went down to the library, my eldest actually asked me to go for something scary. Now, obviously I don't know what's scary to her, but I, I uh, tried to pick out something that may be scary. Now the first one um, is The Land of Stories, The Wishing Spell um, by Chris Colfer, which um, if you don't know, um, and maybe you haven't watched, is actually Kurt from Glee. So uh, this was his first novel, not sure actually how good it's going to be, but going uh, by the blurb at the back, it sounds pretty good. Uh, the other one that I picked up for my eldest is um, Goblins by Philip Reeve. Again, um, at the back, it, going by the blurb, it sounds like it could be a bit scary but also a bit funny. So again, it's another different one to try. Now, for my seven-year-old, um, again, she's a very, very girly girl. So the first one I picked up was The Flip Flop Club. Now, I've not heard of this one before, but uh, it seems like a good series of books to start with. So I thought I'd give it a go for her. And... Um, one of her absolute favourites is Horrid Henry. Uh, she she reads a lot of these at school, watches it on the telly. Um, I'm actually not sure if she's read this one or not, but I'm pretty sure she'd love to read it again. Um, for my five-year-old, Princess Fairy. Can't go wrong with a princess book. Princess Fairy by Penny Dale. You can just see by the illustration at the front, it's going to be very girly. Um, sure she's going to love this i'll show you just a couple of like the illustrations inside it looks quite um quite classic looking very nice fairy tale um now in one of my other library hall videos i mentioned a book um with the illustrations from quentin blake now this one mustard custard grumble betty and gravy is actually a book full of poetry now my eldest really enjoys poetry she um she actually writes some herself uh, so I thought this might be a bit inspiring to her, but with the illustrations included, I thought it might be a bit entertaining for my other children too. Um, for my youngest this week, now she picked this one herself. She is slightly Cinderella obsessed at the minute. I'm actually preparing for a Cinderella birth at the end of the month. Um, obviously, we all know the tale, but there's so many different books with so many different pictures. It's just a little bit different again, and um, it's something she's really into, so I know she's going to sit and enjoy reading it with me. And the last one on the list is Kippa and Rolly. See, Kippa has always been a favourite of mine. I think it's um, it's a classic when it comes to kids' books these days. And um, I've read them with all of my children, so it's nice to be able to read it with my youngest too. So there we have it. There's this week's library haul. I hope it's given you a bit of inspiration. Do hit the like button below. Um, tell me in the comments if you're enjoying these videos. And I hope you subscribe.